So I'm uh, just going to say a few words by way of introduction to Mia. Um, anyway, I want to express that this lecture somehow came to me as a kind of a gift. And uh, I didn't plan it, but it just came. And um, I want to share with you that experience. Um, before I, I start the lecture, as I did prepare it, I, I want to start with a very small exercise, a very small <coughs> meditation form, to give you some experience of living forward, how you can tap into that kind of uh, energy. And it's, it's, it's a very small form of, you can call it meditation, you can call it exercise, you can call it whatever you want. Um, so it's just an invitation to um, give yourself a small kind of start. And the invitation is, is um, I will use a small mantra uh, to uh, help yourself with your breathing in and breathing out. And the mantra I will use for this time is So Ham, which means I am. And um, with, when you breathe in, you do so, and when you breathe out, you do hum. So the meaning is so hum. So hum is I am. And we do this by uh, contacting different layers of um, what we can experience as levels of consciousness or where we can connect to different levels of energy we can experience in the body. And we, we go through these different um, places where you can sense some specific energy by breathing in and out with this so hum. That's the way to connect with this bodily felt energy. Okay? So you can close your eyes if that feels good for you. I will do it myself also. And you start by making connection to the center of the earth. You, you bring your attention deep into the earth beneath your feet. And you breathe in and out so hum. And you connect with the energy of the earth, the center the earth beneath your feet. And then you take the vitality, the life force of the earth. You take that through your feet, through your legs, into the basic center of your body. You could call it the the root chakra, but doesn't matter how you call it. It's just the bottom of your body. It's the place where you can feel your right to take a place in the world, your existence in this body. And you just bring your attention deep down into your body and you do so um, several times. energetic center in your body. This is a center in your body, in your abdomen, where you can sense your sexuality, but where you can also sense the integration of the masculine and feminine 
qualities and your create creativity. So you bring your attention in that energetic place in your body. And you bring in the vitality there by breathing so hum. You awaken the energy in that part of your body. And then you go to a next level of consciousness. This is the, in your body, the place, <coughs> you could call it the hara, this is the, the, the middle part. And that's the part where the energy is of your personal power, your personal identity, the, the way you, you as a person, you as an individual, want to be in the world and want to be powerful in the way you are. So you bring your attention at that level in your body. You are aware of the energy that can be there and you can awaken by just breathing in and out so hum a few times. Then you go to the center of your body where your heart is. You could call it the heart chakra, or you could call it the whole center of energy where we feel our connection also with other people. And we have these qualities of heartfelt connection. So bring your attention to the region of your heart and you breathe in and out with so hum to just open up that space in your body. Then you go to the next center of energy. That's the center of your throat, but it's also your arms, your hands, your fingers. It's the whole uh, field of communication, of expression, of giving words, but also of reaching out with your hands. So the whole energy of communication. So you, you are aware of how that whole field in your body is connected to how you communicate and how you have a grounded communication. It's vital <coughs> and nourished from the down. So take your time to just feel the living forward in these parts of your body. And then you go to the next center of energy. It's the center where the eyes, the ears, the brain are included. It's a center of clarity, seeing clear, listening in a pure way, thinking with clarity. So bring in your attention in that whole region and awaken this vital energy there by just breathing in and out with this soul hum. <coughs> 
then go you go to the top of your head and it's like you can have the an, an opening an opening to what's above you like we can breathe in oxygen in, in, in that center of our body we can create the opening where we can inhale and exhale and make our connection to what is bigger than this small body. We can open up to what's above us. So take your time to open up the vital energy that you can feel there at the top of your head. It's, it's an opening. Babies are born with that opening. But to adults, we, we close gradually. So we can open up at the energetic level. Finally, you can make connection with all these pure energy that transcends your individual personality and that has these pure qualities of compassion, wisdom, and where you have some inspiration coming in where you can connect to all this pure energy, you can use many names for it. In fact, you can call it the unknown, you can call it the divine, you can call it spirit, you can give it a more concrete name that has that functions as a handle for you. Whatever for you is this higher self, this transpersonal source. And you make your connection with that. And you breathe in and out with this soul. And then we make a quick return. You, you take this inspiration, this healing, whatever <coughs> you need from the bigger system, you take that with you, you take it through your upper chakra at the top of your head and you receive it there. You, and you do this, you inhale deeply and you exhale so on by just as if you're taking the flood of energy, like a golden light or whatever, you take that in, in that upper level of your, of the top of your head. You take it to the next energy center where you have this clarity. You breathe in and you exhale, so on, just to bring that energy in that center, to receive it there. And then you go to the center where your communication is expressed, your throat, your arms, your hands, your fingers. Breathe in, so and breathe out, so on. And then you go to your heart center. You breathe in, you breathe out, so on. And then you go to your center where you personal power, 
is there. And you give it this inspiration, this nourishment from the bigger system. And you breathe in, you breathe out, so on. Then you go to your next center where you find your sexuality, your creativity, the integration of your masculine and feminine side. You breathe in, you breathe out, so on. And then you go to your basic center where you have your place in this existence. Take your place in your existence. Breathe in, breathe out, so on. And finally, you are aware of being part of nature and how your body is just there as an expression of living forward between the center of the earth and what comes from far above you. And your body is just integrating all these energies. And you breathe one last time, like so on. small experience already of living forward. <laughs>